Ever wondered why goats don't write letters? Because they're terrified of being accused of butting in. That's right, folks. We're kicking things off with a little goat humor. But we promise there's more to these creatures than their knack for making us chuckle. With a history as rich and varied as the patterns on their coats, goats have been a part of our lives for centuries. Now that we've had our chuckles, let's dive head first into the intriguing world of goats. Would you believe me if I told you goats have been around for over 10,000 years? Yes, you heard it right. Goats and humans have been pals for a really, really long time. It's believed that these feisty creatures were first domesticated around 10,000 years ago in the Middle East. That's right, folks. Before there were skyscrapers, before there were highways, there were goats. In the grand timeline of human history, the domestication of goats marks a pivotal moment. It's when we, as a species, started to transition from a nomadic lifestyle to a more settled, agricultural way of life. These hardy animals were more than just pets. They were a vital part of early agricultural societies, providing milk, meat, and hide. Imagine this, you're living in an ancient settlement. There's no grocery store around the corner, no delivery service to bring you dinner. You depend on your environment for survival, and that's where goats come in. They're easy to care for, they're adaptable, and they're multi-purpose. A goat is like the Swiss army knife of livestock. Need milk? You've got a goat for that. Need meat? Goats got you covered. Need a warm hide to protect you from the elements? Thank a goat. Goats were more than just a source of food and clothing. They were companions and helpers, a lifeline in a challenging world. They helped plow fields, carry goods, and even provided a source of entertainment. Ever tried to outstare a goat? It's a pastime that dates back millennia. So next time you see a goat, remember this. These creatures have seen civilizations rise and fall. They've witnessed wars, peace treaties, and the invention of countless technologies. They've been around longer than the pyramids, the Great Wall of China, and even Stonehenge. They were here long before the internet, cars, and even sliced bread. Goats, ladies and gentlemen, are true survivors, standing the test of time with a hearty bah and a head held high. So the next time you see a goat, remember, they were here long before the internet, cars, and even sliced bread. Did you know goats were the unsung heroes of the Middle Ages? Yes, you heard it right, those bearded bleeding bundles of joy were actually the backbone of medieval societies. You might be thinking, how on earth could goats be so important? Well, let me enlighten you. First off, goats were the medieval equivalent of a grocery store. They provided milk, meat, and wool. Goat milk was especially valued. It was not only consumed as a drink, but also used to make cheese. And let me tell you, nothing beat the taste of fresh goat cheese after a hard day's work in the medieval fields. Goat meat, meanwhile, was a staple in the diet of the common folk. It was versatile, nutritious, and most importantly, readily available. After all, when you're living in times where the next meal isn't guaranteed, having a reliable source of protein is a big deal. Goat wool, though not as soft as sheep's wool, was still highly sought after. It was spun into thread and woven into fabric, providing much-needed clothing and blankets. Imagine snuggling under a warm goat wool blanket on a chilly medieval night. Sounds cozy, doesn't it? But it wasn't just the products they provided that made goats so valuable. These animals were incredibly hardy. They could survive harsh weather conditions and were able to subsist on sparse vegetation. This made them ideal for peasants who didn't have the resources to keep more demanding livestock. Another fascinating aspect is their role in land management. Goats were natural-born landscapers. Their grazing helped to control plant growth and prevent the spread of scrubland. This was crucial in maintaining fertile fields for crops. And let's not forget their role as companions. Goats were often kept as pets and were known for their playful and curious nature. They provided a source of joy and entertainment during what were often very tough times. So while knights and princesses get all the glory, it's really the goats who deserve a round of applause. They were the unsung heroes of the Middle Ages, providing sustenance, warmth, and even a bit of fun. Let's take a moment to appreciate these medieval munchers, shall we? From the Middle East to the far corners of the world, goats are real globetrotters. Indeed, our furry friends sure know how to get around. Their journey, much like ours, is woven with tales of exploration, discovery, and survival. So buckle up as we trot along the goat tracks that crisscross our global map. Our story takes us back several thousand years when the first goats started trotting out of the Middle East. They found their way to Europe via ancient trade routes, becoming a common sight from the hilly terrains of Greece to the green pastures of Ireland. 
The Romans, those great builders and conquerors, were also fervent goat herders. They carried goats along with them as they expanded their empire, introducing these versatile creatures to new lands and cultures. But Europe was just the beginning. These intrepid explorers soon set their sights on Africa. The goat's ability to adapt to diverse climates, coupled with their usefulness as sources of milk, meat, and hide, made them a valuable asset for the African communities. The Sahara Desert, the Nile River Valley, the lush rainforests of the Congo, goats trotted through them all, becoming an integral part of the African landscape. The last leg of our journey takes us across the Atlantic. When Columbus set sail for the New World, he had goats on board his ships. Yes, you heard it right. Goats were among the first Old World animals to set hoof on the Americas. They played a vital role in the survival and growth of early colonies, providing settlers with essential food and materials. And just like that, goats had trotted their way around the world, from the Middle East to Europe, from Africa to the Americas. These resilient creatures have made their mark on every continent, in every climate, and within every culture they've encountered. So whether you're in the Swiss Alps or the plains of Africa, you're never too far from a goat. These global trotters have trotted their way into our hearts and homes, and it's hard to imagine a world without them. From farms to city parks, goats have adapted to modern life just like us. They've proved themselves to be not only resilient, but also versatile, fitting comfortably into our evolving societies. Now let's talk about goats and their role in the 21st century. You might be surprised to know that goats are not just about meat and milk anymore. They've been providing us with so much more. For instance, they've taken on the role of being eco-friendly lawnmowers. That's right, folks. Goats are employed by many cities and homeowners to control weed growth naturally, reducing the need for harmful chemicals. They've got an insatiable appetite and can chow down on everything from poison ivy to thorny bushes. And the best part? They fertilize as they go. But goats don't stop at weed control. They've also found their way into the bustling streets of our cities. Urban goat keeping is on the rise with many city dwellers realizing the benefits of having these friendly creatures around. They're low maintenance, they're great with kids, and let's face it, they're a whole lot cuter than a lawnmower. And as if that wasn't enough, goats have also ventured into the world of wellness. Ever heard of goat yoga? Yes, you heard it right. Goat yoga is a thing. It combines the relaxation of yoga with the therapeutic effects of interacting with animals. Imagine holding your downward dog pose with a baby goat balancing on your back. It's a unique experience that's taking the world by storm. So, goats have indeed come a long way. From being ancient symbols of fertility to medieval munchers, and now to modern marvels. They've adapted, evolved, and proved their worth in more ways than one. They're not just livestock anymore, they're part of our communities, our cities, and even our exercise routines. So, the next time you're stuck in traffic, just remember somewhere in the world, there's a goat doing yoga. Let's take a trip down memory lane, shall we? We began our journey with a light-hearted goat joke that set the tone for our exploration of the history of goats. We then traveled back in time to the early years of goat domestication, where these four-legged friends first made their mark on human society. From there, we ventured into the medieval era, a time when goats were known as the medieval munchers, playing a vital role in agriculture and daily life. They were the unsung heroes of the time, providing milk, meat, and companionship to our ancestors. Then we followed the hooves of these global trotters as they journeyed across the world, adapting to various climates and cultures. These goats truly were the original globetrotters, making their mark on every continent. Finally, we arrived in the modern era, where goats continue to awe and inspire us with their versatility. From starring in viral internet videos to practicing yoga, these modern marvels have truly shown us their range. Throughout this journey, we've used humor to highlight the fascinating, sometimes humorous aspects of goat history, because despite their serious contributions to our society, goats have always had a knack for making us smile. So, there you have it. The history of goats from ancient munchers to modern yogis. And to think all this time, they were just kidding around. Let's wrap up our exhilarating and laughter-inducing journey through the fascinating universe of goats. We've traversed through their remarkable world, where we've beheld their extraordinary characteristics, witnessed their playful antics, and learned about their unique contributions to the environment and agriculture. 
we've discovered how these adorable creatures can climb trees, balance on tiny ledges, and jump with an agility that's awe-inspiring. We've learnt about the various breeds of goats, their distinctive traits, and what sets them apart from each other. From the majestic mountain goats, with their sure-footed adeptness in the harshest terrains, to the charming pygmy goats, known for their friendly demeanor and compact size, we've covered them all in our riveting journey. We've also unearthed interesting goat facts. Did you know they have rectangular pupils or that they were one of the first animals to be tamed by humans? We've seen how they contribute to sustainable farming, providing milk, cheese and wool and acting as natural lawnmowers, reducing the need for fossil fuel-driven machinery. And don't think we've forgotten about the goat's famous bleeding. Their unique sounds have certainly added a humorous note to our goat expedition. It's been a journey filled with entertainment, knowledge, and plenty of giggles. As we conclude this venture, let's take a moment to appreciate these incredible creatures for all their charm, versatility, and resilience. But our exploration doesn't end here. We'll continue our journey discovering more about the wonderful world of animals. So don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more thrilling goat adventures and much more. We're excited for the fascinating discoveries that lie ahead. Thanks for watching and remember, keep on goading!